This is the entrance to Green Valley Ranch. Look at how beautiful this place is. It's so much quieter than the strip. Which would be a good or a bad thing, I guess. It's very pretty. So here we walk in the door. This is walking in the front door of the casino. Our cab driver said that there's a really good um, pizza place here. He said that there's lots of good restaurants and he said that the slot machines pay out a hell of a lot more than they do on the strip. So hopefully that is worth the $50 cab ride to get here from the Cosmo. Yeah, it's really pretty in here. So this is the lobby when you check in. Really cool bar right back there. Very nice people so far. It's very quiet here compared to the strip, but it is absolutely beautiful. Um, there's right around the corner that way, there's an oyster bar restaurant that oh my gosh the menu looks amazing and then there's a um, like a breakfast place but they do um, breakfast lunch and dinner they're open 24 7 called the lucky penny um, and their price the thing is Stan and I were both saying that the prices here are very very comparable um, very good price pretty little bar right there it is very very pretty in here so. High limits room. Huge casino. I'm surprised at how big the casino is. Yeah, it is way on that yonder. There's movie theaters. So a lot of times the properties that are off strip um, kind of, hey, there's a uh, fat burger. Um, but the properties off strip kind of come all in compass for entertainment purposes, you know, outside of just gambling as far as like, um, we've stayed at Red Rock before and they had movie theater, um, bowling alleys, you know, even arcades for kids. So they kind of do things like that um, to keep people happy and entertained since this is the only casino you know anywhere around so but we're gonna go get a player's car see if we can earn some points oh well and this is the pool area which in august we're all gonna want to be out here they won't let us <laughs> stand the sun feels fantastic look how freaking cute these little cabanas are though you know we'll get in trouble for going over here but for y'all, you know I break all the rules. Look how cute this cabana is. Now, these are in the shade. I don't know if somebody would want to rent them, um, you know, but. Oh. And then on the other side of the pool, they have what they call the sandbar and grill. We'll, we'll walk as far as we can without getting in trouble because there's nobody here. Look at this. That's so cute. Look how pretty all of that is. The building itself is just, it's very different than um, like your typical just hotel or what you see on the strip. This just, this has personality to it, I guess, for lack of better terms. But it is so pretty. Yeah, all the mountains in the background. I swear, I think that it is. Their pool is a um, section of it is a sandy bottom pool. 
There's another cabana. Look, so you have your own little beach. Red Rock had that too, and it was so cool. Look how pretty this is. Might even have a lazy river. Might be a lazy river, it's hard to tell. But very pretty. Definitely spend time out here. Okay, we've definitely decided we are going to stay at Green Valley Ranch during Porcon because we've played two machines since being here and have won more in the last 30 minutes than we have probably in the past year of staying on the strip. The slots like pay out way more money here than they do on the strip.